Hello YouTube friends, welcome to the Red Parrot channel. I am your host, Mary Ellen. This is an episode of Junk Journal Around Robin. It is day eight. November, it is a November swap and daily ephemera making collaboration among um, me, Charlotte Shell's Creative Chaos, and Cindy at Studio Lou. Check out their channels because they are also publishing a video per day for the month of November as well. And you will see uh, the same thing appear on multiple tables. So if uh, Shell has sent um, me something, she quite likely has sent Cindy the same thing. Um, maybe not on the same day, but eventually, and then you'll be able to see two completely different approaches to the same kind of items. So today, uh, I confess that I am a numpty. I had a video and uh, YouTube ate my video. So I can't do the opening and everything because I've already done the make. And here is the make. Uh, Cindy gave me a uh, um, page that had uh, ducks on it. And she gave me this frame. And Shell gave me this uh, big sheet, sticker sheet. And I peeled the whole thing off put it onto um, a substrate and create a journaling card. So we've got those that are already done. So I am not gonna be off, however, whoa ho ho, because we have all of this. So we should be able to make some things with the leftovers of the leftovers. Because anything worth doing is worth overdoing. And like I say, there's nothing more enjoyable than doing these cards. So, um, let's have at her. So we've got some yummy things. Um, this card is nice. And this is another bit. This is another bit. We saw that before. Here are some pieces from the journal with me from Cindy uh, for the month of mm, November. Look at that. I'm gonna put that to the side, I think. Uh, also, journal with me. That's a fun bit. Um, we didn't use these stamps yet. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sound like hamster. Got that. We have a page. That'd be interesting. What else do I have here? I have some more pages. More pages. Oh dear. That's Gracie running around. She's a banana head. I don't know what's out there. Really, I don't. It's part of an envelope. So I think these are bit bits. Oh yes, those <clears throat> are important bit bits. Those are template bit bits. Um, oh, this is another card. And then oh, another card. Oh, that's a circle. Bit bits. Okay. We've got loads. We've got loads of stuff here. Which is literally what we would be doing if I was opening... Oh, and this one. Oh, and this and this. Okay. We got stuff. We got stuff to work with. Loads of stuff. Ooh, we do have loads of stuff. Okay. So let's clear that out of the way. By clear out of the way, I mean just sort of brush to the side, pretend it's not there. That would make an amazing side tuck. I like that. Or a belly band maybe? I don't know, okay, focus, focus. So we've got some substrate. make like a collage board. Okay. 
Okay, let's think. Let's think. Oh, I was so sad when I saw that episode eight had been eaten. The thing that I wanted to highlight that I remember particularly was the peeling of the sticker, that one big sheet and then putting it down on a piece of paper. That is a joyous activity, absolutely joyous to be able to, I think that's one of the things that I like so much about washi tape and stickers is the peeling activity. Maybe it's a sensory thing as much as anything. So I'm going to put these off to the side, I think. Oh, I've got two of those. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, so I think I want to make journal cards. And the question is, do I have backing for it all? to figure out how large these are. That's how big is this? It's a little over six. Oh, okay. Ooh, I like that. that side better because it's got a capital B. No capital letters on that side. So there's three and a half. So what's the, that's a half. Do that. have given me extras in the event of an emergency and I've never had to pull the emergency ripcord. <laughs> so if I have another if I have another video fail that's what I can do. And I don't do I do that? I don't think I do. Which is shame on me. So there's that. Okay. And this. Uh, where is three and a half? Oh, okay. Do that. Still haven't gotten a new blade. Oh, dear. Well, I don't know what to say. I know, I know. You know what to say, don't you, Gracie girl? The um, leaves are, f uh, it is raining as it does in fall, uh, rains leaves, the, this of all of the, oh, it actually goes that way, not the other way around. That's hilarious. Come here. Um, there's three and there's a half. I didn't cut that right. Oh well. It's just, um, and so the leaves sometimes wander over and bang against the window, and that is very, very upsetting for one little pui cat of mine. All right, well, it's not a big deal. All right, so we've got one. Got 
but I kind of like it better this way though. Because that sticks up. And that's kind of fun. Yeah, let's do that. Oops. having a nice long drink of water now that's good that means that we might be what might be gearing up for a <laughs> sleep until 4 p.m because we do need our beauty sleep there okay now then what do we want to do here so we've got that we've got that I don't want point necessarily, but just sort of that. There, that's better. Okay, now I need and a half kind of my go-to uh, measurement there yeah I'm just gonna make a this is something that Rachel at Roxy Creation does a lot, and that is just takes a piece of paper, folds it in two, and it's like, boom, there's your substrate. You don't need cardboard. You don't need anything. Just a little bit of paper. There. And let's just cut that off. Scissors for that. That's a great word snippet. We don't use a lot of hand, uh, our own handwriting, and I wonder why that is. I think a lot of people have a weird relationship with their own handwriting. By that I mean it's it's you know not good or some other kind of negative thought. building the card. My basketball team, which is the Toronto Raptors, is on a West Coast tour. And a West Coast tour, while 
very fun for competitive reasons. Sucks for sleep reasons because it's on the West Coast and the games don't start until 10 p.m., which I find is terribly rude. Most inconsiderate. Okay, we'll do that then. Should make that over a bit. This is going to be a chonky card when it's done. There. There, okay. That really does need to dry up. Let's put that in the dryer. There. Okay, so what do we want to do with this? I'm covering up all the stamps, but I think I'm not, not a problem. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Oops, to be up a layer. There's that. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Of course I am. <laughs> oh, so here's the thing. When you use a Kleenex <laughs> with gluey fingers, this Kleenex sticks. Go pop that on there. Just like that. I don't do a lot of uh, sewing around the edges of cards, and I think more's the pity. There, I like that a lot. And, um, It says while in a happy to an hour 100 percent so i never know if i've told you this or not so i just if I've repeated myself, you know what to do. Um, so I am on fairly good terms with Gracie's vet because my Gracie's vet 
loves, absolutely loves Gracie. And part of the reason why is because Gracie is a really good cat when she goes to the vet. Ha <laughs> caveat. There we are. Uh, I'm just going to pop that off. There. Okay. That's one. Anyways. Um, showing interest and affection with other people in the 21st century. Uh, Post-internet. Is sending each other memes. And then... Greasy's vet case, I do a lot of cat memes. And that leads to other relevant cat information, and so we are cat buddies. Oh, that might be um a whale tail. But I need something that's that shows a lot of this. Pardon me, Peter. Um, oh, before I do that, let's check this. I don't think so. So, uh, nope, nope. That is so much fussy cutting. But it's a possibility. So anyways, um, apparently the dollar store in Canada is selling, unless the internet said so, so it must be true. That might be fun. I'm going with something that's green, apparently. Ooh, those are nice. So is that. Okay, we've got a lot of choice. I'm going to stop giving myself choices. Yes, I am. I will get to the point. I will get to the point. Um, so I won't do anything and I will give you the point. The point is the dollar store is selling uh, cat scratching posts that you assemble and they are in the shape of a gingerbread house. So I'm currently on the search for that. Apparently, according to the vet, they had ones last year that were haunted houses. Halloween haunted houses where hurricanes hardly happen. It's an obscure reference to My Fair Lady. But we're not going out today, I don't think. We can do that tomorrow. Today is a big self care day. Yeah, that's just not gonna work. Mm, not the right color scheme. I think it's this green down here that's making me want. Maybe. Okay. So, um, Last resort, let's say. So he will fit, that will fit. That's too big. Now the red might be nice. And that green goes almost perfectly, so we're gonna do this one. So I've checked two dollar stores already and I have not found anything, but did get uh, a little, I was gonna say Christmas gag, Christmas, an elf outfit for Gracie, which I completely understand is not something that she really enjoys. Essentially what you do, what I do, 
as I get everything ready, put her on, put her in, take the obligatory Instagrammable picture, and then take it off before she tears it off. So, so she doesn't get tormented by having to wear it for a long period of time. She gets a tiny amount of torment because her mother is a creature of the digital world. said this before or if I haven't I've said it in my head I need to figure out the um how I'm going to put this journal together meaning the mechanics I have an idea I don't think I'm going to use the pamphlet stitch because I don't think it will work I'm really curious to see what the um the final product looks like because I don't think I certainly have not seen one and I absolutely never made one journal that goes like this like uh, here's a journal made as randomly as you possibly can and even then not particularly random there. So that was a very good choice. I got paper everywhere. I need, what do I need? I need here. And a whale tail. While I'm up. Yeah, while I'm up. Oops. I'll do two. There. And then this is the one I want. Go like that. Yes. That so doesn't go. That sort of formal old German and, hey, I'm a poet. The great actually goes very nicely with that pink. With passion? With passion. Okay. Um... Oops. There, that's all right. I feel like that needs something, another like tiny little layer between here and here. Okay, stop. That goes there. I don't think that's the right color. That's better.
Oh, I'm covering a bee. ran over that glob of glue that I put down. <sighs> Needs to go back over on that side. there. Didn't I have three cards? She says, looking around curiously. No, I just had two. Oh, it's here. Never mind. Found it. So we've got that, which I like. Oh, I gotta trim that. There. Now I've got that. I want to paint these. We'll do that maybe at the end if there's time. Oh, wait. And then this one. So what are we gonna do here? What are we gonna do here? Look at these honking big circles. They might be fun with that. So that's the color. Is this blank yet? Yes, it is. Okay. Um, I don't think there's anything here that I wanted. Blue isn't really maybe. And this is all too light. It's kind of upsetting. does kind of go with the blue. Vegetables might. Well, let's see. Let's see, see, see. I need a sweet tea. Hmm. 
This feels the most, um, it, the food goes with the salt and pepper in the kitchen. To lose a little bit of the edge of that. Sad but true. I'm not going to use that image. That's okay. I'm doing collaging. Oh. Yeah, that'll work. that but I've got to because it's the bottom in here. I'm so careful about keeping every little bit of this German paper because that's how much I value it. just like delicately give a suggestion I like the kettle at the top. Like that. And so that.
there. And this for sure needs that glue there. Ooh, And I just want to make it like that. Get the teapot, the peppermint salt, the other bits. <clears throat> the other stuff I don't really care about. Oops. Wow, okay, that is, I wish that glue would wake up its mind. It's either not flowing at all or it's like, woo, Niagara Falls, mayday. Pat, pat, pat. Here we are, the cap on. Scissor in, scissor in. I don't know if there's a good word. <laughs> a statement on modern uh, food frequently irrelevant. In my defense, I was less left unsupervised. That really doesn't make sense. Don't judge me. No. Today, huh? I'm meant to behave, leave me alone. See, it's all the snark paper. This is the nap. And that also makes no sense. None of these make sense. Well, boo. All right, well, we're gonna... We're gonna do some word hunting. Good luck, Godspeed. These are the most famous ones. I like that. Talking about sea lions, but that's okay. These are the most famous root vegetables. Yep. Uh, straight edge. I saw this from Gail Agostinelli where she takes all her, or takes a bunch of her strips and then she just puts word snippets on them and they're already sort of back, backed. So she doesn't have to do exactly what I'm doing right now, which is to prep some. So I feel like we should do some more of those at some point. Ooh, she's getting skinny. So we're either going to do the yellow or we're going to do the pink. I like the yellow better. It's a little more farmy looking and it's a little more matching of the onions and the other bits that are there. Oops.
that. I just don't want to bang up the carrots so much. There, that's better. There. Ooh, I like that. So we rescued the day, which I think is pretty terrific. So we used the scraps of the makes from the previous day. And we have three more journaling cards. Love that one. This does not, does not boot down. At all. those bits. Oh, I know what I want. Yep, I'm just going to go over the cheese grater. Because that's my least favorite part of that. None of this really, well, I suppose carrots would. Great carrots for a, che for a cheesecake. For a carrot cake cream cheese dressing. That's where the cheese came from. Also cover some of the wooding. There. I'm not opposed to that at all. And there and there. Okay, so we have got tabs on all of these too. I don't know that I do tabs all that frequently. I like that one a lot. And I love this one. Okay, so I said if I had time that I was going to do some coloring. So let's just swing over here. Um, So I have two pets of crayons. Does this say drawing? Derwent artists. Hang on, we'll find out in a minute. Yep. Pencil crayon, pencil crayon, watercolor. you need much. better okay now now we are done done so three cards today today was day eight and I just want to take these are the two first signatures 
So here's my thought. Here's my, my thinking thought for the moment. That is, I'm not going to use this necessarily, but the idea being that I will tab together. So I will do that and then tab that together. And so these pages will be attached that way. Kind of like we would do an envelope. I'll need tabbing, which is a problem for another day, but that I think is how I'm going to attach them. And also it'll create a thickness here which means there needs to be a spine and then some flexible way because this spine is going to then open pretty cleanly. Each page is going to open as is. The other thing that I could do is use strips of fabric. Ooh. Or the other thing that I could do is the... Um, the alternating tab. So you tab this, you do it this way and this way, and then there's a tab that comes this way, and then a tab that comes this way, and then they would trap. The next one, and then this one has center one again, which traps the next one. So I've got some options for how I'm going to attach it. But I think the spine is then going to become a cohesive element. Yes. So that is all. Oh, and the other thing uh, I found is uh, some ribbon. Uh, I was on my, I found the ribbon in a bin and it was part of a bow and I took the bow apart and this is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful light ribbon, which I think I might use to tie this journal together once I get it made. So it'll be purple. Anyways, that is all for now. Let us pray to the uh, internet gods that this uploads uh, and also pray to the internet gods that I don't touch anything that I shouldn't while it is uploading. Anyways, that is all for now. Thank you so much for joining me. Please check out Cindy and um, Shell at Shell's Creative Chaos because they're doing the same thing that I am with slightly different projects and different and equally fabulous results. Please take very good care of yourself. Uh, stay out of trouble. Love you lots, and we'll see you soon. Bye now.